Father Greg Boyle, a Jesuit priest and author who has worked with gang members in some of the toughest neighborhoods in L.A. for decades, has said that a more precise translation of the Beatitudes is not blessed are or happy are, but you're in the right place if. It turns out the Beatitudes is not a spirituality, he said. It's a geography. It tells you where to stand. So consider these. We're in the right place if we are standing and embracing our poverty and that of others. For one day we will stand very close to God. Maybe we are standing there already. We're in the right place if we are standing before coffins and graves, weeping for those now beyond our sight for we will feel the arm of God around our shoulders. We're in the right place if we are standing behind and beneath others and letting them go first and receive the best of everything, for we have many blessings coming our way. We're in the right place if we are hungering and thirsting for what is right, if justice brings us alive and injustice moves us to action, for we someday will be satisfied. We're in the right place if we speak words of mercy instead of aggression and accusation, for mercy will find its way back to us and make its home in us. We're in the right place if our words and actions are pure love, for we will see God in our own reflection. We're in the right place if we are making and embracing peace with those around us, no matter their faults, their addictions, their histories, their origins and leanings and orientations, for then we are accepting our given place as children of God. We're in the right place if we're ruffling a few feathers, if we're hated for our hatred of injustice and our acceptance of the little, the weak, and the oppressed, for we will find ourselves sitting in the lap of God.